Hey, just take a look around at the excitement in the air here. 50, almost 100 students stayed after school late, made all the signs on their own, and then took the city bus over here to see if they could save a school that they say is saving them. Students were fired up and ready to fight for their school in East Hartford. It's called Synergy, a school of second chances. I used to be one of those students that, that the teachers didn't want in class, that they kicked out every single day. But now, two years later, Angel is leading the rally outside City Hall to save his school. I'm going to show every single teacher that said that I'm not going to graduate in time. I'm going to tell you right now that thanks to Synergy, thanks to all the Synergy staff, that they, they helped me get through this. While Angel will graduate, he's worried about the younger students left behind. Right now, the budget axe is falling, cutting Synergy, closing its doors, and ending the hopes of more than 100 students. I would have stayed back freshman year. I wouldn't even make it to sophomore year, which I am now. And I think I could, if they, if we save Synergy, I think that I could make it beyond um, sophomore year. It was standing room only as students filed into the chambers with their banners and numbers. Even graduates, success stories like Gustavo, who now hold a job and have a future thanks to Synergy. It changed me. You know, it's like a newborn person. You know, you become somebody else. You know, you get your things straight. Tonight, students say this is just the first round. Even though it's just a public hearing, they'll be back day in, day out to make sure that the Board of Education gets the message. Don't shut down our school. I'm Bob Wilson on the scene in East Hartford, News 8.